Hey, Taylor. Lauren! Oh, come on, girl. You can't tell me you're still in bed. You have a dress fitting for your wedding in two hours? I know. I know. I'm... What? Oh, my gosh. Your wedding is in two months. You can't tell me that you're not excited about this. That you seem not. So what's yeah, up? Yeah, I know. It's just... Jason has been acting strange lately. He doesn't want to talk about the wedding, and whenever I do, he gets short-tempered. Are you serious? As he seemed pretty excited when we went out to brunch yesterday. You know, he's just been acting strange. Wait, he isn't hitting no, you, is he? No, he's just... Long phone calls, more busier than usual. Something is definitely off. Well, have you... Tried talking to him? Yeah, I know, but he seems to put the conversation off about our wedding every time. Well, um, have you prayed about it? Lauren. Lauren. I'm sorry, Taylor. I think I will pray about it. I'll still meet you and the girls later. All right. Well, look. <sighs> Give it to God, okay? And I will see you, and you better not be late. I love you. I love you too. Bye. God, I pray for your strength today as I step into the world. Give me your eyes so that I can see all that there is to see. Give me your ears so that I can listen intently to every morsel of instruction and in tune to every sign that you may give. Give me your heart so that I can learn to be more compassionate. Show me what is and what is not in your will for me, though. Amen. Hey, sweetheart. Hey. How'd you sleep last night? I slept okay. I was about to meet my girls for the dress fitting, but I think we should talk. Oh, well, what's wrong? Our wedding is in two months, and you seem to be distant. Lauren, are you serious? You know that I'm busy with work. We're working 10 to 12 hours a day. I mean, I'm just tired. Yeah, but... But what? But what? I mean, I just proposed to you. Isn't that enough? Look, I'm, I'm sorry. I love you. I just feel like you're overthinking it. And I'm on my way to work. I just stopped by before I went to my meeting. I'm going to use the bathroom, okay? helping you ladies out today. So, who's the lucky lady? Lauren! <laughs> Sorry, I'm the lucky bride. It's just so pretty in here. Why, oh, thank you. So many brides come here and they are infatuated with our shop. So what type of dress are you looking for exactly? Um, something kind of fitted, not too much going on. Very elegant. Well, let's see. We have a few here that I feel may be right up your alley. I've seen this dress elsewhere and I love this one. I think I'm gonna try this one with this one. Yes. Okay, well the room is here where you can try it on and I'll be here if you need help. Oh, I'll help her. Okay, well you ladies just let me know if you need anything. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, so, did you pray? I did. But Jason came over and some woman named Alyssa called him. I didn't answer. What? Shh, keep your voice down. 
Okay, look, listen. You and Jason really need to talk. I mean, he seems like a decent man. And I can't believe that he would cheat on you if that is the case. I know. Maybe I'm just overthinking. Uh, maybe. But you two really need to communicate. I've tried. It just seems like he has cold feet or something. Well, what was that? Oh, Lauren, this dress. It is beautiful. I think I'm gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> Let's walk out so the others can see it. Okay. Look, I'll get the back. Oh, goodness. Oh my goodness, dear. You look so beautiful. Yes, you do. I love it. Thanks. You guys are the best. I personally love this dress. It really compliments you. Thanks. I think I'm still going to try the other one on. This one seems a little uncomfortable at the bottom. Hmm, let's see. Maybe we can alter it if this is the one you would go for. Maybe make it shorter in the front. It's your fiance. Wait, doesn't he know you're being fitted for your wedding dress today? Rude. <laughs> What's wrong with her? Mother Nature? <laughs> we all have our days. It's hard being a woman sometimes. Yeah, well, let's go ahead and try the second dress on. <laughs> My coworker Kelly is going to finish helping you ladies. I have to leave. What? Oh, uh, where's Alyssa? She left. She said she had to go. Yeah, she seemed kind of upset. I pray everything is okay. Well, listen, Lauren, I have to hurry and get to class. I'm sure you're going to make the right choice. Congratulations. I love you too. Thanks for coming. Bye. I think I'm gonna go too. I have to pick up my mom's medication and she's waiting for me, so. Tell your mom I said hi. Thanks for coming. You know, I think you should answer this phone, else he's gonna keep calling. Yeah, just hand it here. Hey, baby. Well, I'm still at the bridal shop with my mom and Taylor. I'm outside. Jason, I don't want you to see me in my... What? Uh, Jason's outside and he says he needs to talk. He's here? He couldn't wait? He's coming right now. Oh my god. Lauren, I know this isn't the place or the time, but I have to tell you the truth. I... Uh, I cheated on you with Alyssa, and she works here, and I'm sorry. What? I'm really sorry. Please just listen to me. I'm but sorry. No. How could you? Jason, why? Especially out of all the places, you just had to do this here? Listen, I mean, I'm, I'm sorry. I love your daughter. I don't know. I'm really sorry. How can you say you love my daughter when you cheated on her? You know what? I think you should leave. Leave. Just leave. Sorry, Mom. Sorry, Taylor. I'm just a sorry woman. God, dear Lord, I know that your word does not return void, and I'm believing great things for my daughter. May she find comfort in your ability, God, to reach her, hold her, and rescue her. Let her find confidence in you, Lord. Even when the hard times come and she doesn't know what to do, by keeping her eyes fixed on you, may she grow in a relationship deeply with you. In Jesus' name, amen.
Thank you, God. I'm a strong woman. I've dealt with hard times, sometimes crying myself to sleep. I've wiped my tears and managed to pick myself up again. I've grown through the things that were meant to break me and have become stronger. Thank you for the blessings you continue to pour out and for showing me that faith in you is so worth it. I have nothing but you, God, to thank for all of this. I love you. Amen. Thank you.